Good afternoon, viewers and listeners of Tech Point Zone. Today's video is going to be talking about cylinder expiry date or cylinder test due date. Some people believe that cylinders have expiry date, while others believe no, it only has test due date. Now, for this particular cylinder, which is total gas cylinder, uh, what is printed on it is test due date, which is 2013 December. So, in this particular case, it means this cylinder was meant to have been retested in 2013 that's December so for for this particular cylinder if you check the ISO standard it is ISO 22991 and this ISO was of 2004 reviewed in 2018 and according to ISO.org it's meant to be reviewed every five five years so coming back to the test due date if you're not from Nigeria yours might come in alphanumeric prints or maybe if your cylinder is not that of total gas it might come in alphanumeric print. So if this was to come in alphanumeric print, it would have come as D13. D meaning the fourth quarter and 13 meaning 2013. That's year 2013 fourth quarter. So you can have four types of uh, alphanumeric prints for your cylinder starting from A to B to C to D. A is first quarter. B is second quarter, C it cost is third quarter, while D is the last quarter. So for this particular test due date of 2013 December, if it was to come in alphanumeric print, it would have been D13. D mean the meaning the fourth quarter, 13 meaning the year 2013. And I hope the regulatory bodies out there are going to be pushing these energy providers for uh, uh, compliance on this test due date so that we can have more safety for all the users of these LPG cylinders. Please like, subscribe and hit the bell notification icon if this video helps and then see you in the next video. Bye for now.